Hi Scorpio, welcome back to my channel, Unique Carol. This is going to be your September 1st to the 7th messages from Spirit. Okay, this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, and Jupiter as well. This is for Scorpio, September the 1st to the 7th, 2021, for Scorpios. All right. I'm hearing the month of September 2022 will be significant for some of you Scorpios. So remember I said that, okay? Or maybe last year was, or maybe this month will be lead up to something that will happen next September or something like that. All right, so Scorpio, September the 1st to the 7th, 2021 for Scorpio, sun, moon, rising, and Venus for my Scorpios. All right, I should put this back because Spirit's telling me to, but I'm going to leave it. Moon, the Magician, and the Two of Wands. So I'm getting some kind of moon magic or some kind of uh, black magic here already. I don't know why, but I am. Okay, the Two of Wands can be uh, uh, making a decision here. Planning something or putting a plan into action, the Two of Wands. All right. Yeah, somebody's doing magic to put a plan into action to move something forward here. Okay. Somebody wants a certain outcome with the world card. Somebody wants the world or, or somebody is someone's world and they want this person in there. Let's see. Yeah, it could be a, a Virgo, a pre-empress energy. It could be dealing with a Gemini, a Cancer, or a Virgo. Yeah, definitely could be a Virgo. These are both Virgo cards. All right, so let's see. What's the moon and the magician here for Scorpio? The chariot could be dealing with a cancer. A lot of majors are out here. So a major change is this first week. Yeah, the king of pentacles and the two of cups, the four of wands. So I'm getting you want to commit to somebody. You want to be with somebody. I'm getting you're being strategic here or trying to really, really figure out a way on how to move in towards this person, Scorpio. Yeah, the hierophant. I'm getting a lot of you could be going through a legal situation here. You could be struggling financially as well. What is this? For I saw something here. What, what was that? Is there a card flipped over? Yeah, there is. I knew it. What is this card? The devil, Capricorn energy. So there it is. The devil, the moon, and the magician. You're doing magic here, Scorpios. Well, this is someone doing it on you. It could be a Cancer, a Gemini, or a Capricorn. I'm getting heavy Cancer right now. But but this could be you, Scorpio. This is your reading. So with the Devil, the Moon, and the Magician, I'm getting someone's doing magic to move something forward to gain a victory here with the, with the Chariot card. Somebody wants a victory, Two of Wands. It's like somebody's willing to do whatever it takes to gain this access, to have this option, to have this person or to have this opportunity, whatever it may be. It could be a person, a job or whatever. We have three, three, three here. So the angels are here protecting someone from this black magic that's being done because it is being done. Somebody wants a victory. Someone wants someone to choose them or to be with them. So they're willing to do black magic in order for that to happen or to try to get it to happen. All right. Yeah. Yeah, the King of Pentacles, Two of Cups, Four of Wands. Somebody somebody is being very strategic. Seven of Swords, very sneaky with how they do this. They want this, they want to be the one to provide. They want a relationship with you. Maybe you're very abundant. Or the, it could mean this person just wants to provide for you and be with you. Okay, the King of Pentacles is committal. That's marriage. With the four of wands, I'm getting somebody wants someone to marry them. To say yes to maybe a proposal that they're planning here. Okay, but they're manipulating their way around this here. What's the devil? Yeah, the strength card. Leo energy. A lot of majors here. You only got one minor here in all majors and it's six cards. Yeah, the devil and the strength. The strength could be loyalty or or something. Yeah, knight of pentacles. What's the what's the strength card with the devil? Yeah, the empress. There it is. There's that Empress. There's the Five of Cups, Scorpio. So you're doing you're doing magic on a Libra 
or it could be vice versa. Libra's doing this on you. Somebody could be, somebody could be um, a, a Libra sun and a Leo moon, literally. Somebody could be a Leo moon. I'm a Libra sun, Leo moon. I already know somebody's attempting magic on me. So, as a Libra. So, anyways, this Scorpio, they're attempting, but it's not working. So, this Scorpio or whoever this is really wants you to choose them. They want you to make a decision to be with them. Maybe they're threatened. Maybe they feel like there's a king of pentacles or there's a pose. There's somebody else here that you're looking at. So somebody's doing what they feel they have to do here. I'm getting with the strength card. If you have heavy placements in Leo, it's hard to do magic on someone. Leos are strength. They're protected from that shit. It's hard to do magic on a Leo. That's why not only is it hard to do magic on me as a Leo moon, but it's it's just hard, period. But anyway, so, so Scorpio, you're doing magic for this Libra to come back or to get this Libra to choose you, to si decide to be with you so you can win. You want a victory here with this person, all right? But I'm getting it's not going to work. The strength, they, they have strong spiritual goons or, or, or something. Yeah, this is you, Scorpio, five of cups. You're disappointed here. Okay, what's the strength card? What's the strength? Yeah, the world. That's the that's the ring of fire, Saturn. Something's over. Yeah, the hermit. The world. This person is protected. It's going to stop. It's going to be closed out. It's not going to work. Okay? The hermit is our everyday routines, Virgo energy. You could be doing this every single day. This magic. This magic is not going to work. Yeah, eight of swords. You're trying to bind someone. Or sabotage someone, Eight of Swords. Or make someone come back here. Yeah, you're trying to sabotage someone. Okay, this is something you're doing over and over again. Nine of Wands to no avail. You're too insecure. You don't have the courage. You're insecure, very insecure. Devil, strength, and nine of wands. Or this is this person with you, Scorpio. You know which side. But somebody's very insecure to even approach you. They, so they do magic here to try to manipulate a situation. I feel like somebody's doing magic to try to sabotage you, though, with the eight of swords and the five of pentacles. Somebody's trying to bring struggle. Yeah, seven of wands. Look how the universe coming through. Like, fuck no. This person's this person's wealth, their business is protected. There's nothing you can do. This keeps coming out like this. Somebody keeps practicing this magic. We have the world, the strength, and the seven of wands. That spirit saying no. This person is very, very spiritually protected. Ancestors, goons, Archangel Michael here. Like they, they keep showing up. You can't do this on this person. This is not the way you're going to get this person by practicing this magic. It is not going to be a victory. This person is protected. They have very strong spiritual goons. Very strong. Strength card. Very strong. All around them. Literally like in a circle with their arms crossed. Protecting this Libra. Or this is this this is you being protected from this magic that this Libra is trying to do. It could be a Libra, a Leo, a Virgo, or a Capricorn, a Gemini, a Cancer. But when I clarify certain cards, when I clarify the devil, it was the Empress. Somebody's obsessed with this Libra. And because this Libra is rejecting them, seven of wands, turning them down, rejecting them, maybe even blocking them, ghosting them with the hermit. Somebody, somebody, yeah, somebody with the strength in the seven of wands, somebody's really holding back from someone. I'm getting somebody celibate here too as well, but I'm getting somebody's really holding back. They're rejecting this person and this person, so they feel like, or, they, or they're fearful of being rejected or they know this person is going to reject them. They know it's over world card. So somebody's manipulating magic and it's not going to work temperance here. They're not going to allow this person to do this work. Our angel Michael is here with the world card. I'm getting somebody is doing this. Every, yeah, the the King of Swords covered. Our, this is Archangel Michael. He's the Swords, blue energy. He carries the um color blue. This is him, literally speaking. I work with Archangel Michael. So if there's so he's literally letting me know if this is message for me that nobody's gonna do shit. Here he is again. His incense is burning right there, and I have his candle. 
So if you're cross watching or doing whatever, Scorpio, if this is you doing this on this Libra or Capricorn or Leo or whatever, it's not going to work. They're too protected. And if somebody's doing this to you, Scorpio, you're too protected. It's not going to work. Seven of Wands, Strength, um, World Card, Temperance, and the King of Swords. Our angel Michael is here. He will not allow it. Every time he will not. This person even, our angel Michael watches you even in your sleep. This, you're very, you're, if you have a child, they're very protected too. What's the messages here? Yeah, the five of swords. Ten of swords, yeah. Somebody very jealous, very nasty, very vindictive. Yeah, six of cups, ten of swords. This is someone from your past that betrayed you. That stabbed you in the back over and over, played mind games, was jealous, malicious, low vibrational, very jealous of you. Somebody's very jealous of you and your stance, your position, your everything. Yeah, the high priestess, the seven of pentacles, the lovers, and the fool card. With the queen of wands, ace of swords, somebody wants, Scorpio, this is you or somebody else. But somebody wants a new beginning here. But somebody's hateful though. Somebody's jealous and hateful. Tell me what this Empress is up here with the, uh, with the, um, yeah, the Eight of Cups. This Empress walked away emotionally and blocked somebody ass. Like, no, don't even call me. This part, this, this Empress was guided, or this is you, Scorpio, was to walk away by their spirit guides with the Hermit. Yeah, and somebody walked right into abundance, okay? Yeah, somebody tried to bring the tower, the tower, the ten of wands, ten of pentacles. Somebody tried to bring the tower down to somebody's life. And instead, now they're receiving karma and they're struggling is what I'm getting. What's the empress and the high priestess? Empress, high priestess. Empress and the high priestess. We got the will of fortune here. Yeah, and the knight of swords. I'm getting karma. I'm getting instant karma is what I'm getting. And nine of swords. I'm getting somebody tried to play mind games. Somebody was jealous, hateful, and did all this betrayal shit here. And, and that shit backfired. Some, even this magic that somebody's trying to do on someone to get them back to, to do a come to me sale. Because we got the eight of cups going this way, which is walking away from this devil, from this manipulator, from this narcissist or whatever. This 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 devil, this black magic doing person. Somebody walked is walked away right here. And then it's like somebody's making you come back. Eight of Cups. You're walking away, but somebody's doing a spell to try to get you to come back here. They're trying to turn back the tans of time or fuck with destiny. And you know that they are with the high priestess. You're a high priestess. You're a psychic. You can block this person. You can read this person's thoughts if you wanted to. And I'm getting sometimes you do. That's how you tap in and know what the fuck they're doing next. All right. Or trying to do. All right. Yeah, we have the star card here. Somebody could be in the public eye. I'm getting there's no hope for this to move forward. Yeah, the queen of wands, the king of wands, three of cups. Somebody's really holding on to the, to, to the thought of a reconciliation here. Somebody's obsessed with your ass. Very attracted to you as well. Somebody's obsessed with your status as well. The higher find the uh somebody, what's the star card? What's the star card? Yeah, the three of cups. Somebody's a lit celebrity. That's literally being celebrated. Somebody has great talent here. All right. Somebody could be very spiritual with the star and the high priestess here in the in the emperor. Somebody could be an empath, a psychic here. Okay, a medium of some sort. I'm hearing mediumship. Someone could speak with past on loved ones. What's the three of cups? I'm getting somebody's yeah, the lover. Somebody's in 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 a in a um very very spiritual here. Very yeah, the queen of swords, page of pentacles. Somebody's a leader, or they teach, or they do some, or they speak out for a living, or they work with the youth, or something. What's that? Yeah, the ten of wands. What's the ten of wands? What's the Ten of Wands? I'm getting you walked away to new love, Scorpio, or somebody else here. Yeah, the Three of Swords. I feel like somebody's stressed out and heartbroken here. Somebody really wants a second chance with the Judgment card. Okay. I mean, really. What's all these damn cards? Yeah. 
Nine of Pentacles with the Queen of Wands. I'm getting somebody's fine as hell. All right. Somebody, you can expect money to come in. If some of you are waiting on money that's coming in, I'm getting somebody's taking their place in the world. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. I'm getting grants. A lot of you are making a lot of money here. There's a, Also, if this is a legal situation or it has anything to do with child support, something's going to be coming in here. I'm getting something's going to happen here or you're going to be surprised at some information or something that comes out regarding a legal situation. Scorpio, this could be with the Libra, with the Justice, and here you are, Scorpio. Yeah, the Fool, the Page of Pentacles, the King, the Queen of Swords, Eight of Wands. I'm getting you want a new beginning with this Libra. Or I'm getting, I'm getting something went haywire or, you, or something ended, Scorpio. This you, the tower, you ended something with one Libra. And now you're looking straight at this other Libra. <laughs> yeah, the tower and the death. You ended things with one Libra and you're going quickly, fast, quick hurry to a, towards another Libra. Could be an empress, a, a baby mama, or... Yeah, nine of cups. Somebody's really doing well in their career. Very celebrated, very sexy, very strong, very powerful here. We have the king to the queen of wands with the two of cups and the four of wands. This could be a twin flame connection here with the sun and the ace of cups. Wow. I'm getting somebody is being somebody. Yeah, four of swords. That's Libra energy. Somebody's not going to. Yeah, the six of wands. Somebody very popular. Okay, the Eight of Pentacles. I'm getting somebody is very skilled at their work and what they do here. All right, somebody's professional, great talent is here. Yeah, the Fool and the Page of Pentacles. I'm getting somebody's taking off in their career. All right, new ideas, they're expanding. Somebody's doing well and somebody else is lost or hurt or 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 bitter or revengeful. Yeah, the Queen of Swords. Somebody's a, we got a heavy Libra here. Somebody's in the public eye. Somebody's doing very well. They're a speaker. They're a psychic or a healer or an astrologer. Okay. The Wheel of Fortune and the Star card. Somebody could read natal charts or they're going to. Maybe be in a palmistry. All types of things. Somebody's going to be a world-renowned star here with the world card. Six of Wands, Three of Cups, the Star card. Very celebrated. Somebody's spoiled rotten this Libra. The universe spoils them. Because they're doing what they're divinely guided to do. Somebody's trying to do magic to, to fuck that up or bring somebody back in. It's not going to work. Eight of Wands. Yeah, I'm getting... Somebody's gaining a following here quickly, too. Yeah, Queen of Wands, King of Wands, Two of Cups, Ace of Wands, Page Mind. Wow. Somebody's very attracted to you, Scorpio. Or you are to this person. Very attracted. You want a relationship? You are stuck on this person. You are like, fuck that. I got to have this person daydreaming about a seven of cups ace of cups what it would be like to be in love with this person or be with this person this could be someone at a distance doesn't have to be i'm getting you lost someone here scorpios all right 808 was on the clock so that's the number of abundance yeah the five of pentacles you feel out in the cold i'm getting somebody's doing magic on somebody's abundance somebody's trying to get someone to lose their wealth you had all this wealth ten of pentacles six eight nine all these pentacles down to the five you was the queen all this so somebody's trying to get someone to, yeah because they're annoyed at your position they're jealous and hateful devil five of swords yeah four of wands they're trying to get you homeless or put out of your house or or in a situation yeah nine of swords a hangman where you need them now somebody's feeling guilty nine of swords because because yeah two of cups it, it did nothing but drive you further away from them and it makes you, the more magic this person does on this beautiful entity here, this healer, this beautiful person is the more that you lose, Scorpio. So if this is you, you're losing and you're a loser. And you're going to be broke, provish, struggling and everything. Somebody's going to end up being put out of their home, losing everything here because of what they're trying to take from somebody else. I'm also getting somebody's car is going to be taken as well. They're going to lose everything. Even, if, even this person that they chose over this empress... They're going to lose that person, too, because that person's going to find come. what's going to come out is that they're a betrayer or they're a liar, a cheater, con, or they got somebody else on the side. A bunch of shit is going to come out. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. The higher font and the death. This is you, Scorpio. Ten of swords, the death, the five of pentacles. I'm getting something in it for you. A relationship that you tried to run off to or something that ended. 
you want to be back with someone from your past, your baby mama, ex, you have a judgment in reverse. I'm getting it's not going to work. You're not going to be granted this. If you're wishing to be with this person, the, the higher ups, the universe is saying no. You don't deserve this person. For all the magic you've done, for wishing bad, for sending bad ill will to this person, for doing whatever you've done to this person, whether it was abuse, hurt, or in, in any way, you're going to have to pay for that for a lifetime. When you were trying to see this person out and you were trying to keep this person from doing what they do or doing black magic or stopping them, not only are they going to continue to do what they do, they're going to have karmic fame. They're going to be rich, and you're, but you're going to watch them be happy with somebody else. And you're going to live a mediocre, raggedy life that and meet people who run over you, use you, and play you. Just the same way you tried to do this person that you could have really lived a good life with, but you chose your path. And I'm getting you chose the wrong one. Two of swords, bad decision. Now you're hanging on to the thought of being with this person for the rest of your life. So those are your messages, Scorpio, or this is the other person. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video.